What's going on guys? Etika from the Etika World Network here to bring you something a little bit different. Now a lot of you guys are asking me, you know Etika, how the hell can you, you know, talk about these Fire Emblem characters without understanding where they come from? You need to play yourselves in Fire Emblem. And I got in the request a lot to the point where I kind of cracked and I said, you know what, I'll try it out for you guys. Now before we go into this any further, this is not an official Let's Play. This is not something that I'm telling you guys I'm going to finish like other series. Which, funnily enough, I haven't finished a lot of them. But anyways, I'm, like, I, like I'm saying, this is not going to be something I'm probably going to go through all the way if I don't like it that much. We're going to try it. The Fire Emblem Awakening demo is actually on the Nintendo eShop for the 3DS, and I just downloaded it. So, what we are going to do today is basically play through it. As you guys can see, I literally just finished downloading it, and it, um, it says right here, new software has been added to the home menu, and um, you guys can't see it. There we go, you see? So, that's Fire Emblem The Awakening demo inside that little gift box there. We're going to try it out. The only reason why I'm going through with this, well, there's two reasons. You guys gave me a lot of um, convincing and um, actually no, you guys aren't even the main reason, no offense, but the main reason why I wanted to try this demo out is because I'm loving Robin in Super Smash Brothers right now. Holy shit. He slash she. The moves! I haven't seen anything so unique. And we also got a little bit more information from Sakurai talking about what certain moves will do and how certain things work in the game. I'm loving the concept of Robin right now, especially that Nosferatu thing, which is one of the only healing moves in Super Smash, you know? I, I love that. So that's the main reason why I want to try this game out. And the second reason is because I made a goddamn comment asking you guys if you would want to see me play through this, and so many of you replied. It was, it was overwhelming, so... That was definitely the final straw to break the camel's back. We're going to be playing through this right now, so let's open this little package up. There we go. So you guys can you guys can know I'm doing all this for the first time. I haven't played the game at all yet. I have not played a... F okay, we got 30 uses remaining. Launch this demo. Here we go. But yeah, as you guys can see, I haven't played this game at all before. Only thing I know about it is that it's sort of like a military strategic planning game. I don't know what the story's like either, so here we go. Okay, I don't know the song behind I don't know the song beyond this point, so okay. Press any button. Here we go. Alright, so difficulty, we got normal for series beginners, hard for expert, well, experienced players, and lunatic for expert players. So let's go with that lunatic difficulty. <laughs> Actually, nah, I'm just playing. I, I wouldn't do that to myself, but um, we can definitely go with normal. Oh, boy, I hope you guys can see me while I mess with my light a little bit, so kind of might be a little dark on the camera, but let me make sure. But yeah, man, I mean, we're gonna play through this demo, we're gonna see what we can do. If I'm interested in the game enough from this demo, then I'll do a full Let's Play of it and you guys will be able to watch me. I really am interested to see the story behind these characters, you know, Robin, Lucina. I want to kind of know where they stand, like, to see where all the hype is, but, hey, let's see. Okay, so game mode. Fallen units return. You can save anywhere casual. Units are lost forever. Each decision counts. You can't choose classic in the demo version. So let's go with casual. Oh shit, Robin! <laughs> there goes my girl right there. That's my girl. I and mean, dude's cool too, but that's my girl right there. The white hair? Oh yes, we can we, we can definitely go. Robin's gonna be a main. Palutena's gonna be a main. Kirby's gonna be a main. Kirby's the sexiest one out of all of them bitches. <laughs> Anyways, um, so create an avatar. I'm sorry, man. I like uh... Nigga, you can't choose female Robin in the demo? What kind of sexist shit is this, Nintendo? What if, what if I had a vagina? You're not going to let me play with a female cat. It doesn't even matter if I have a vagina or not. My genitals aren't what's important here. How are you not going to let me play as a girl in the demo? This is so stupid. She's the, well, well, the dude looks cool too. No homo, the dude looks good, the dude looks good too. But I mean, come on. Well, you know what, whatever. I guess I'll have to suck it up. After all, this is just a trying out type of thing. So whatever, let's go. Now, um, create an av- wow, okay, so I didn't know that in Fire Emblem the character creation would be so deep, so let's see. You can't choose a build, not available in the demo. You can't choose a face, not available in the demo. You can't choose your hair, not available. Well, I mean, it is a demo, so I guess I can't be too mad, but... Can't customize anything about them in the demo. Choose a name for your avatar. Let's just go with the 
typical Robin thing, you know. I mean, I like the name Robin. There we go. Name is Robin. Birthday, May 12th. That's my, that's my actual birthday, by the way. Asset, HP, strength, magic. Let's go with magic, since, you know, Robin seems to be a magic-based person. The flaw. Let's make your flaw luck. Use this avatar. Let's go. Alright, so this is pretty cool. I didn't know the customization went so deep in Fire Emblem. Kind of took me by surprise. I'm, I'm liking it so far. Let's see what this game has to offer, man. We have to do something. What do you propose we do? I don't know. Are these anime cutscenes in this game? I see you're awake now. Hey there. My nigga Crumb. There are better places to take a nap than on the ground, you know. Give me your hand. Give me your hand. Sorry about the audio stuff, guys. Crom, damn, is he trying to like, make out with my ass or something? But anyways, okay, so I didn't know they had anime cutscenes in this game. It's pretty cool. Is this throughout the whole game or is this just something they put on all for the right. demo? I also like the fact that they have voice acting all over this bitch. Yeah, that's a nice feature. The audio is skipping at some points, guys, so I apologize for that. It's just, it's kind of, kind of a problem I got to figure you, out. Crom. Okay, so it's not voice acting throughout the whole thing, it's just certain things. Damn, man, this audio is skipping like crazy right now. We gotta figure this out. Um, you know, I'll worry about it when I start up the next video. But anyways, okay, so let's see. Hmm. Crom, how curious. Tell me, what's your name and what brings you here? Um, and why are you so sexual? My name is... Hmm? He doesn't remember his own name? Hmm. I'm not sure if... I'm sorry, but where am I exactly? What? Hey, I've heard of this. It's called amnesia. Explain. It's called a load of Pegasus dung. This nigga needs to shut the fuck up. He's talking about dung, but look at his damn outfit. Um, we're, we're to believe you remember my lord's name, but not your own? Huh? But it's the truth. <sighs> what if it is true, Frederick? We can't just leave him here, alone and confused. What sort of shepherds would we be then? You see, I bet Fedrick wouldn't be talking shit if we were the female Robin. He would be like, oh, we have to help this damsel, you know? We, oh, gosh, we, we have to make sure that we provide the most the, the, the most sufficient care for this girl. How, how sad. But nah, I'm a dude, so he's shitting on me. Just the same, my lord, I must emphasize caution. T'would not do to let a wolf into our flock. Right. Right then. We'll take him back to town and sort this out there. Wait, just one moment. Do I have a say in this? Peace, my nigga. I promise, we'll hear all you have to say back in the town. Now come. I'm liking it so far. I can't lie, guys. I'm really liking it so far. Fire Emblem Awakening. Very nice so far on the 3DS. I just gotta work past that little audio issue I'm having with my recording device, but... Alright, so what will you do with me? Am I to be your prisoner? Ha. <laughs> You'll be free to go once we establish that you're no enemy of Yulis. So I'm guessing Yulis must be like the continent or something? Huh? Is that where we are, Yulis? Ah. You've never heard of the Haladzim. He plays quite the fool. This nigga needs to shut the fuck up. <laughs> he's, a, he's a dick on wheels right now, yo. The furrowed brow is especially convincing. <laughs> Frederick, please. Shut the fuck up. This land is known as, oh, I skipped that. I, su I suppose proper introductions are in order. My name is Krom, but then again, you already knew that because Krom is a sexy bastard. If only he knew by, if only he knew at this point that he would not be in Smash. He, he would have probably not even gone through with this game. The delicate one here is my little sister, Lisa. I am I not delicate. Ignore my brother, please. He can be a bit of a prick sometimes. But you're lucky the shepherds found you. Brygans would have been a rude awakening.